Hello everyone, Ronnie J here from InternetRadioStation.com. This very short video is going to show you how to mark a song for PAL VoiceOver Intro. For example, if you'll be using voiceovers, and I covered this in a previous video, then you will need to mark your songs to use the voiceovers. Sound Broadcaster will not play a voiceover on each and every song. You have to tell Sam which songs you want to have a voiceover on. It is my practice to place voiceovers on all of my new songs. When I say new songs, I'm talking about new releases. And this is how you do it. You want to make sure that you've loaded up some voiceovers inside your voiceover and your request voiceover categories, as you can see that I have. Under the voiceover category, I have two voiceovers. And under the request voiceovers, I also have two. I could right-click on a voiceover and do a song info and go to settings and listen to that voiceover by clicking on this play button here. Lifting your soul higher. We are your smooth jazz leader, WRIP Rip Radio Smooth Jazz Radio at ripradio.com. Make sure that when you load in your voiceovers, make sure that this is all the way up at the top. I want to also make sure that the gap killer here is disabled. When you go in, you're going to probably find it at the default setting. Make sure it's set to disabled go to fading and make sure that the fade out and fade in are disabled and you know that because you hope your mouse button over there it says override make sure that's set to the override position then click OK and do that for each and every voiceover so I just done that one so I'll go to the second one do a right click song info settings the volume is all the way up to the top the gap killer is disabled fading the enable fade out and enable fade in are both overridden. Click OK. In fact, your graph should look like this. Click OK. And under the request for servers, I have two there. If I click on that, song info, and go to settings. And I'm going to play that. Here's another hot smooth jazz request. All right. And gap killer is disabled. Fading. Make sure both the enable fade out and enable fade in are both disabled or overridden. Check your graph. That's how it should look. Click OK. And the last one. Song info. Settings. Gap killers disabled. Fading. And we'll disable the fade out and fade in settings. And click OK. So we're all set there. And incidentally, if you recall in a previous video, I showed you how to import your items into your various categories. It's the same way for your voiceovers. These will be MP3 files, whether they're files that you recorded or you had someone professionally do for you. And just as a review, to import your voiceovers into these categories, you would select a category, then click Add Directory, navigate to where your voiceovers are. Mine, in this example, are here in my voiceovers and also have the other one for request voiceovers here. Then click OK. And I've already imported mine here, so I don't need to do it again. But that's all you're doing. Your next step is to tag your songs. So I'll go over to the queue, and here's one by Act of Faith, if you believe. I'll tag that one, and I'll tag the one by Al Z Ramsey. So to tag your songs to use the voiceovers, you would highlight the song, right click, Song Info. We'll go to Settings, and the way this works is, is that you play the song for about six seconds by clicking on the play button here and you can watch this indicator right here then stop it then right here it says intro double click in this area and make sure that in time is set to six seconds click OK click OK and I'm gonna do another one here at Al Z Ramsey I'll right click on that one song info I'll go to settings Again, play the song for six seconds. And watch this indicator right here. Stop it. Intro error, double click. Make sure that the edit time is set to six seconds. Click OK and click OK. So I've marked two songs here, Act of Faith, if you believe, and Al Z Ramsey on Flagger Drive to use the voiceovers. The one here in the middle by David Sanborn doesn't have a tag assigned to it. Your next step is to go into your PAL script area, and mine is on desktop C. 
and I already got the PAL script loaded and if you recall what I did was I simply clicked on the plus symbol I ticked on this automatically start script I navigated to the location where that PAL script was voiceover aux1 for this auxiliary player over here I highlighted that and clicked open and it imported it right here all I have to do now is start it so we'll do a right click start and over to the left hand side in auxiliary one we can see that the first voiceover has been loaded into aux1 and it's standing by it's not playing yet it is simply waiting for a marked song as it says here waiting for one tracks to play now if we go back to my desktop a I can go ahead and start my sound broadcaster and right now in the deck B is a song by Cindy Bradley footprints and I'll go ahead and start this up and it will play now once I advance this song the next song that you'll play will be Act of Faith if you believe and that will go into deck A and we should hear a voiceover because I tagged that song. So let's advance this song here. Hi, I'm Ronnie J. You're listening to the smoothest jazz radio station on the planet. Here's more smooth jazz right here. And that's how it works. I'm going to go ahead and advance this song by David Sanborn and the next song to load up into Deck A will be the one by Alzi Ramsey, and recall this is the one that we had marked. Advancing the song, loading up. Hi, I'm Ronnie J. You're listening to the smoothest jazz radio station on the planet. Here's more smooth jazz right here. I'm going to pause this, and I'm going to mark one more song, and I'm going to reset my PAL script. And I'll mark the one here by down to the bone. Settings. And I'll play the song for six seconds. Watching this right here. I'll stop it. And I'll start everything back up again. And once I advance this song, it will fade out and down to the bone will fade in and we should hear a voiceover. Advancing the song now. Lifting your soul higher. We are your smooth jazz leader. WRIP Rip Radio Smooth Jazz Radio at ripradio.com Isn't that cool? And that's the way it works. This is Ronnie J from InternetRadioStation.com and also at RipRadio.com. Thank you for listening.